different video than usual, but I decided, <laughs> hey, we should do a video together, and what better video than something to do with Avatar, because everyone loves Avatar, especially recently with it being on Netflix, and I've also always wanted to do the tier ranking kind of thing, mm -hmm. so being as there's already one made of ranking the characters, decided, hey, why not argue with my girlfriend here and see what characters are best? So... <laughs> can't argue. Sir. Just go in the line because... Just make it easy. Okay. So... Well, controversial... Aang is what okay. Would you say? What would you say about Aang? Aang's okay. Listen, he... For me, Aang is not S tier until maybe... No, I don't think S he ever reaches S tier. S -tier. No. I, I would be fine with people saying A, but it's like, with all the characters that are better than him in my opinion, it's like, A or B in my opinion. Like, uh, I get it, Aang, but come on. If we go by, like, you know, his story and maybe, you know, just basically growing up and becoming serious, he's, he's, he... Barely. A. <laughs> A. Yeah, A for Aang. <laughs> <laughs> Two A's for Aang. Appa? S. S. S tier. <laughs> I'm glad we can agree. Azula? She's one of my favorites. Whoa! Are you for real? All her character is is I'm evil and unhinged. She's cool. But listen, she's the best villain. Because, because she's angry and evil? She's not angry. Yes, yeah, she is. She's not angry. What do you mean she's not angry? If she was angry, she would be uncontrolled. Like, she's only uncontrolled by the last episode. Where she's the most important. <laughs> she's not that important in that episode. That's the thing. Listen, all her character is is just angry evil. I will go no higher than a B. Fine. We'll do cool. that. Ugh. Who's this guy? I so don't that's remember their, I think that's her uncle. That's their uncle. Yes, okay. Uh, I forget his whatever. name. So we're gonna say, uh, he didn't do much. Oh, no. He, didn't he do wasn't much. there. No, yeah. no, no. F. 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 He wasn't there. I... I'm fine, D. We'll go in the middle. Still a good guy. Cabbage. Cabbage man. See, if we take into account he's... just Aang, just Avatar, last airbender, he's F. But he's funny. He's not. He's a joke. All he is is a joke character. All he is a joke. But Momo is also... No, he's not. No, he's not. <laughs> D. Yeah. Alright. Sparky, Sparky Boo Man. F. F. It's like, what? He's just... He's just... Okay, he has a power. He has a power and you fight him. And the only thing good about him is that Sokka uses his boomerang once. And it Hits actually works. Hits him in the head. And that's and it. And he dies. And he blows himself up. It's like he's not a bad character. It's just like he's kind of useless. So why is he fucking... He's just a, a one-time bad character. Mm-hmm. Whatever. Who's this guy I can't even see? Sand people. Oh, this fucking... Hold on. That's the person that stole Appa! Asshole category. <laughs> <laughs> Asshole. There. Because <laughs> that's a different... There's villains and then there's... I have a bad hate for this guy. Yeah, and then there's... Because I see him and I was like, I know who this guy is. <laughs> just, just from that episode. <laughs> Alright, Monk... Hurt. Monk Yatsu. Ah, I love this guy. Mm -hmm. I don't think... I don't think he's better than Aang, but I wouldn't put him any lower than Aang. Because, like, yeah, he's dead the whole thing, but, like, every time he's shown, he's such a, in his life the he's whole such a time. good character to Aang. Even for as he has small amount of his life he's been in, he's been a huge impact. So it's uh, like, I think he's yeah, A. Yeah. Okay. So, their dad. Asshole. Really? Why is he an asshole? I will just go with just asshole. He left his kids! <laughs> I mean, he was fighting in the war. I think it he just have to. I don't think he entirely <laughs> had to either because it's like, what did they really accomplish without them? But he was there during it. There's what no did way he he's. Do? There's no what way he's he asshole. Do? What did he do? I'd put him in D. I want to put him with F then. We're gonna go right in the middle. You wanna put him in D? I'll put him in F. Fine. Listen. Okay. <sighs> Bloodbender. I forget her name. But. Um. Uh, 
Kaya. Listen, she is an asshole. Right? But she's a really fucking cool villain. That whole episode was fantastic. That episode's so... That, and that episode so cool. made waterbending deadly. <laughs> and fucking scary. There's no way it's lower than C. She's lower than C. I think B. She's as crazy evil I agree. as Azula. So I agree. I'm going to go with that. I'm happy with that. This guy, I forget who this is. This is, this guy. This is uh, the earthbending kid that they first met. And he stayed because he stayed with his, uh, he got enslaved with his whole family, his whole village. Oh, yeah. Okay. Well, I mean, that was a... What did he do? Eh, it's just a middle character. I think he got a mustache. That's what he did. That's all. C or D. That's what I'm thinking. D. He's not as important as those people. He got no C's yet. All right, let's just <laughs> let, 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 let's just we quickly let's just quickly agree there. I don't even know if we need to say too C? much. C, C, this guy. Yeah, yeah C. I agree. He could be our first C because he is influential because he scared Aang <laughs> from firebending I for just, another season. He, <laughs> he's he's a good good middle ground. All right, Jet. But he stays in the story. Yeah, and he's part of the, the, the what Lotus. is it, Order of the White Lotus? Yeah. <sighs> Jet. I agree. Jet. Oh, Jet. Jet, 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 Jet. He's just kind of like, he needs to chill and just help. Like, how are you going to fight against the Avatar he was, he was because radical you think you're better? He was, he was radical. Very, yeah, he was very radical. Um... I'd go around C. Oh, uh, yeah. I'd, I'd go with C because he's not... I, we're, I guess we're reserving B for really cool villains. Yeah. Really cool villains or really good guys that, you know... But don't not better than Aang. Like, I would put Ty Lee at B. That's not Tyler. It's not Ty Lee? No. Who's that? That's the girl in the tea shop. Oh. Well, that was a nice little arc from that just one episode. Um, Ty Lee's right there. Oh. They got the same face. Come they on. They do, and she looks also <laughs> like Aang. <laughs> yes, exactly. Um, tea shop girl. I mean, she didn't do much, but like, it was still a really nice moment. That was kind of a a, a good, nice point for Zuko. Um, I would put her. I'd put her in C or D. Hmm. When I look at that, She's I kind of think more important. D. I put her in F. Mm. She is not important. I mean, I know she's not important, but... I don't like her. Whatever. Okay, this girl, fucking whatever. Asshole. I don't care. Asshole. Fucking... Oh, this is the this is the girl with the... the what is it called? I don't even know what it's called. It's just a... In Ba Sing Se. Or something like that. This is a girl that's, that's like... That says like that. There, there is no war in Ba Sing yeah, Se or yeah, something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, this woman though, she's got the the mole she's rat cool. thingy. The what is it? I don't even know what it it's is, but it's really it's, cool. Yeah, I really like her. I'd put her in. Mm, I put her where Jet is. I feel that. I feel that. Katara, S tier. S tier. She definitely is like one of the coolest growths of power. Oh my god, the best. Um. <laughs> I think it's, she she deserves it because of her whole arc. She can be a little dense at times, <laughs> and like dense, but like she but has a reason to not. She makes up for it in yeah. like her other aspects of being like. They needed somebody to be taking care of all those damn kids that whole time. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I okay. I'm I'm going for that. Sure. She's been through the most traumatic shit. Boomy, boomy. I love that guy. <laughs> I love Boomy. Oh, I'd put him at A. <laughs> uh, yeah, he's as good as Aang. He's fucking sick. And he even came back for fucking Uber White Lotus shit. So it wasn't even just that beginning part. I love him. The king of bossing say. Fuck that guy. He's not that great. I don't like this guy at all. <laughs> yeah, I think he sucks. Avatar Kiyoshi. The one that goes, kill them, and yeah, <laughs> just kill <I> them. <laughs> We're putting a lot of S here right now. 
I w Cause she's S tonight. I'd say at least... I'd say A. I don't know about S because like, look at these guys. Look at these guys, come on. I know, but Avatar Kiyoshi is like... The best. <laughs> yeah, but like... But then you gotta think she like... She did so much in her... Uh, in her Avatar... Rain? I don't know what you'd call that. Yeah, but like, okay. You but know, like, Avatar Aang at the life. end, Aang at the end changed the game by saying, I ain't even gonna follow you and kill people. I'm gonna fucking take away Benning. And we're gonna say that she's better than Aang, even though like, he surpassed what she would have done. And but did the something thing even is, more Aang right. didn't make that up himself. The freaking Lion Turtle had to tell him that. Yeah, so what? I still, I still think A. She's also like, not the biggest thing. You she know. is S tier to me. Do what you will with that. But this is what hurts our relationship. Wow. There's no way she's going <laughs> S tier. There's no way she's going S tier. There's no way. So this guy. Who is this Since guy? Since he wasn't <laughs> smarter than Azula, he's going to be lower than Azula. I don't even remember him. He was the one that, uh, he was the one that stole Appa. He what? Was, yeah, he was, Appa took his, his shoe. So, so, asshole. Yeah. Nice, okay. He's basically the one hiding. He was Take like, a, he's a, he was the right hand guy for, uh, the, um, the, the king of Boston mm -hmm. and, uh, kind of basically was trying to steal the game but mm -hmm. then azula did and he was like what and he <laughs> yeah asshole all right um, this guy i don't even i mean I, I know he's part of like jet's crew but i think he was one of the better ones in his crew but i also wouldn't put him higher than jet i don't even know why most of the jet crew is here <laughs> yeah i don't know either i would just like, put him i'm with looking jet. ahead and i'm like why no i don't even i don't even think i would put him with jet i'd probably put him with d because it's like I didn't care that much. Yeah, no. D? D. All the jet fucking people need to be in D. Alright, who the fuck Let's be very else? clear with that. That okay. one, that one, and, uh... D. And that one. Uh... Wait, where are we at? Where are right, we at? this one. This guy. And this guy. Well, yeah, all the jet... Club. <laughs> They're fine, but, like, come They're on. D. Look at, those, look at all D. those other characters. Okay, um... I forget her name. This is May. May, yes. May's cool. <laughs> I don't know if I'd say any more than that. She is a basically she she's really important. That's the thing. She's more important than um Ty Lee. So wherever we put May, Ty Lee has to be under. Because really? she's more important than Ty Lee. Well then I'd put her at B. Because I can't imagine putting Tylee in D. I would say so. The, M May's the one that stood up to Azula. That is true. And that's fucking cool as hell for her. She's like, I'm not afraid of and you. It, I love it, him <laughs> more than I fucking hate you. Even <laughs> even though some people might not like it, I still like the fact that they added some fucking dumbass she said, like, teenage I don't, romance. You don't scare me. <laughs> you know? To Azula. The fact that they added the dumbass teenage romance of like I their fucking thing. That. <laughs> freaking episode it's really funny Each episode. <laughs> and ember island love that it was the best okay inventor guy he's inventor cool guy is needed he was important because that's all they used i'd put him in c but thing is yeah yeah c sounds good momo momo <laughs> <laughs> um he's I mean, he's kind of just there, and chilling, being cool, being a flying lemur. D. I'd say, like... Okay. I like Momo. <laughs> I can't say too much more. Alright, is this Fire Lord Ozai here? Yeah. I mean, he's a big asshole, but he's hugely important. I definitely put him... But, like... I mean, I guess not. It's Was all... Was he even that smart? I mean... I don't know. It's abusive father. 
B or C? That's where I would go. Where would you think? He just doesn't fit with C, so I guess B. I think that's right. I think that sounds pretty sound. All right, dickhead alert. Okay. Dickhead alert. But um, he got better. No. Yeah, he did, but when you think about it, like, he didn't get better because of his own realization and shit like that. It was the the off chance that his, his fiance left him, and now that was her grandchild. So, like, if that didn't happen, he wouldn't have had a change of heart. Like, you know what? You've impressed me. I should change my ways. It was, oh, something inconvenienced me in my past, and, and now, like, this? I don't know. He, st he still changed for the better. He is one of the trainers, so I'm gonna have to say... See? Yeah, I get that. And he also was part of the White Lotus, so that helps him, too. This guy. Who's this guy? The sword guy. For the soccer. sword guy. I like the sword guy a lot. What was his name? I don't know the sword guy's name. Jensen or something? <laughs> something. I like him a lot, though, because he knew Sokka was Water Tribe right away. Yeah, and he still, still trained did him. It. He was like, I don't They care. made a fucking meteorite sword. <laughs> He's like, that know. shit's cool as hell. He's like one of the only non benders in the White Lotus. Yeah, and he's cool as hell. I'd put him be. Yeah, I'd go because with he's B. he's he's for the that same feeling of like episode was so so cool. good. That was like my favorite episode yeah. about Sokka. Yeah, like no doubt that was needed. So good. Uh, who's this? Ryoku. Roku. Roku. Why did I say Ryoku? Whatever. Roku. <laughs> <laughs> Roku's cool. I don't know. Roku is cool. He's not Kyoshi status. No, he's not. But and I'd still put why him. Why I would have wanted Kyoshi in S tier? Like, like she didn't need. She needs. She needs to be in S tier because guess what? Guess what? We're gonna have to make a fact. Appa can ride Kyoshi. That's Look. how strong she is as an avatar, as a <laughs> woman. Okay. Listen. She was if, seven feet tall. <laughs> she was seven feet tall. I believe so. Holy shit! <laughs> fact check. Seven feet. <laughs> <laughs> we can change it. I'm tall. If we're we, not changing it, we can't change it. Fine. Roku, B. 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 I guess. Sokka, A. Come on. Yeah. Being mm. a. Oh, never mind. Sorry. Being a non-bender, okay? Can't, you can't do it too fast, all right? You can't do it too fast. Okay, I won't then, do it too fast. I, I gotta think, and then I, I'm like... <laughs> but being like a non-bender... Like, season one, he sucked. Yeah, but it, it kind of made sense why he sucked. Because he, he had didn't no understand the, the gravitas of the situation. He also didn't know what his purpose was. Yeah. He was only he, going because his sister was going. All he wanted was his tribe to be safe and his sister be, to be safe... And once they actually realized, like, realize, was so like, simple. And then he realized, oh wait, life isn't that simple. I mean, he knew the the the, the like urgency of the war and everything, but he yeah, only but knew he his didn't own believe in thing. Aang No, until the end of that first season. Yeah, but it was quick. It was quick because it was you know, yeah. By that end of his first season, and just yeah. the fact that he grew so much, and he's still a kid with no bending, and still fucked people up. Yeah. Good as hell. And Lana. I'm just saying, he's the only one that got laid. <laughs> he got laid. He got laid. <laughs> oh, my God. And not only, like, you know, with his girl, but he went, he stumbled on the fucking, what was it, like, the poetry session. Like, he was like. He was the one that was getting He was all the getting bitches. it. Oh, my God. They call him the backbender. Whoa! <laughs> I've heard that before. That's horrible. I, I love that. Oh man, it's He's true. The that's non-bending, and he got he <laughs> got bitches. That's all I gotta say. And like, it, and then in a uh, fucking Koro, I remember like there was barely anything with him as an as uh, an adult, but the one time he's in a fucking like. <laughs> courtroom or whatever and he's like i remember a guy with a similar power that i named sparky sparky boom man that i took out with my trusty boomerang yeah, and i'm he like still went for it and i'm like you're an adult and you're still sitting here like look at my boomerang <laughs> ah good shit love soccer still went for it anyway who's this guy this is sozen sozen i, I mean, believe 
It is so zen. He's, He's really important. He was angry with Roku. He's really important, especially to the lore. I just put him C, you know? What are you thinking? I mean, they talk a lot about Sozin's comet. It wasn't makes you important. think it's more important, but it's just because you know. It's but it, it kind of was because it was in one of the last episodes because they're like, oh, oh wait, Sozin's comet. Listen, he started the war, but because they were this like, is oh a my list god, of no like, wait, it's the solar eclipse that's gonna do it. But then it was actually Sozin's comet that they were like, we have to do it by this time or they're gonna take over. So I think Sozin's comet is important, but Sozin is not. D. That's D. what I would say. D's <sighs> Suki. Man, Momo seeing him next to Sozin. That's just Yeah, sad. but he's just an animal character. Even to be that important <laughs> for an animal character, that's, it wasn't even the animal character. It yeah. wasn't even Appa. It was yeah. just Momo who was a friend, you know? Yeah. He's a good guy. Appa had like a whole arc. He did. And he didn't once Momo complain. cried once? <laughs> Listen, Momo, Momo was just there to be fun, you know? Appa, they could not have done without him at all. <laughs> at all. They pushed that man to his limits. Yeah. S tier. Momo, I could put C tier, but it's still fine D tier. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Suki, cool as hell. Fucking Suki. love her. I'd put her A or B. Mm. That's where I'd say. Like, there's, I I couldn't imagine her on the same level as she fucking She really jet. is a badass. She really is. She went ahead, like, not even being part of, uh, like, Avatar Aang, like, group. What, what do they call their group? Team Avatar. <laughs> Team Avatar. <laughs> she went ahead and was, like, going undercover and stuff. Like, she was in it. She's fucking In the sick. resistance. So, I believe she is very... Important, more important than Jet, more important than any of those C characters. So I'm going to put her as B. I agree. I agree. I think that's a perfect spot. This kid. Wheelchair guy. <laughs> he's just the son of the the weird guy. Yeah, guy. but I like him better because he actually invented stuff and he's cool. But this guy just used it. I would just put him D because like I can't see him on the same level. I just like his yeah, dad better. all he did was kind of inspire Aang. Yeah. That was about it. About it. Yeah. He was still cool because he was there when they were, like, hidden at the uh, the Upside Down Temple. Yeah. It's cool, <laughs> but... <laughs> the Southern Temple? The Southern Air Temple? Probably. Because they so. have four. They have... Do they have four of them? Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. I think D. I don't like that. Hair in my ear. Does that sound right? Yeah. Agreeance. Asshole. But he's cool. <laughs> he is an asshole. Does he help eventually? I no. forget. No. He doesn't? No. He tried to steal Toph. Yeah, but like much later, does no, he ever turn? he wasn't in it. Really? He no. never turns. He never turned good. He's an asshole. Him and him. But he's an yeah. iconic asshole. He never turned good. I'm going to be real with that. Only the hippo. Oh, he turned good? I believe so. I forget. Okay, assuming Boulder doesn't turn good. I mean, he's like asshole, he's but he's asshole. iconic. He's got asshole energy. Okay. Intense, ridiculous. <laughs> it's, it's just funny. Mad that he got <laughs> beat by a girl. <laughs> it's just funny. Get over it. Toph! Toph! S tier. She she figured out a whole different way of of. It's spending. funny because like her arc isn't even that big, but she was just perfect the whole way she was yeah. just like they just listen i'm a fucking badass and i'm gonna help you all while being like, a badass the entire badass. time i'm gonna be funny i'm gonna be like one of the best benders here and i'm just gonna fucking lead y'all to victory yeah okay we're doing yes. it Ty Lee. and she even later on so c tylee is c yeah you did say i don't like tylee i think she was pointless you know what very thinking shallow of, it, of a character. Thinking of it that way, she definitely... I mean, when you said lower than May, I definitely agree with that. I don't have any argument against putting her in C. I think that like, works. Yeah, fine. she kind of freaked out during Ember Island, but, like, guess what? It wasn't enough. Wasn't as much as May. She's cool. I like the whole chi-blocking shit, but outside of that and being, like, you know, fucking flippy and gymnastic and shit, like, you know... 
She's a good character, but she's not that great. You know, yeah. I, I yeah. don't think she's that yeah. great. So, yeah. anyway, <laughs> who's this? That is Zuko's mother. Oh, she's a sweetheart. She's not that important. What's and, her name again? I don't know. Mother. Exactly. <laughs> um, D. Mm, I would even put her an F. She's not that important. Yeah, because e because even if. If she wasn't a, like a big part of Zuko's life or whatever. Yeah. Ira was exponentially more yeah. to his whole change. So yeah, I sorry mother, you're sweet, but owl, scary asshole. I understand, but you he's know scary. What? But he was he was like woke as fuck. He is. He's really cool. But he's scary. <laughs> scary owl man. I can't see him. I would either have him an asshole or maybe C. Because he's an asshole, but he's also really cool. And I, he's only an asshole because, like, they were trying to do shit. And by the way, another reason Sock is great is because fucking... They wouldn't, oh. have, they wouldn't have got the shit that they got from the library if not for Sokka. So. Exactly. Anyway. What would Sokka's, you say? like, really smart. Love that guy. Anyway. What are we C. feeling? C? I believe C. I agree. Okay. Who fucks this guy? That is the guy that was in charge of the wrestling. Oh. The earth bending fights. I feel like that's just F. Yeah, because he's I not even worthy it, of asshole. I would put him as asshole. But he's like... Boulder's like I iconic asshole. Everyone's like, you remember them for being an asshole. This guy's if just like. If you put Boulder as asshole, he's definitely an asshole. I mean, fine. It doesn't matter. I technically don't see asshole as like specifically lower than F. It's just like a different category of F. He stole Toph with the the guy that used to be his her trainer. Her trainer. Okay. So should we put him in asshole too? Yeah. Okay. All right. Wait. Uh, shit. The last. Name? Three melons. What is her name? That's Yue. Yue. She moon. is she half is, spirit. She gave up her life to be fucking moon spirit. That's, to be fully spirit. I'm proud of that. That's really She saved cool. the world. She did save the world. In just the first season. She really did. That's a good ass character. I... She died. That's correct. But... That sacrifice, I feel like, is worthy to she put her was in B. So, um, what's the word? She wasn't that featured as important in the first part of that those episodes. In the second part, it all adds up mm -hmm. because of season one, the the finale was in two parts. So, with that being said, because of her sacrifice to becoming the moon spirit fully, I would have to say A or B. I put her in B. Because, um, like, I, listen, I guarantee if she stayed there longer, then yeah, then we, we could put her in A. Yeah. But, like, if she, if she didn't sacrifice herself, she'd probably be C or even D. So, we'll put her in B. I think that sounds good, right? Is she, like, one of the first characters we, like, actually see die, basically? Yeah, I think so. I think B's solid. Uh, what the was this guy's name? The last two melons. <laughs> <laughs> what was his name? Admiral Zhao? Zhao. Zhao, okay. Zhao. He wasn't that important. He just kind of tried ass. to kill Zuko. He was an asshole. He was the villain to the villain. Yeah. In the first season. It's like, why are you doing that, bro? He died so fucking crazy. <laughs> oh, wait. How did he die? The Koi spirit. Oh, yeah. <laughs> they went, With Aang. Mm! <laughs> drowned the shit out of him. He said, he said I'm a giant ass Koi. <laughs> just demolished their entire. Like, ah, oh. good shit. He's an asshole. 
I would put him. Ain't no way he's less than, he's more than F though. That's all I'm saying. He's more than F. No way he's more than F. He's more than F. Well, he's, he, what? He? He's just bad guy McGee. He's just bad guy McGee, see, I don't like you. He was not bad guy McGee. That's the thing. Why? Because he was doing his job. Yeah. First of all. We had um, to look up his name. <laughs> what about... I'm not saying he's bad guy McGee because if he's bad guy McGee, I would remember his name. Okay. okay. So <laughs> make your argument. Where would he go? All I'm saying is Admiral Zhao is not unimportant, but he was the villain to the villain of the first season. He is what made Zuko rebel. Where would you put him? I would put him in either C or B. What? Yeah. <laughs> There's no fucking way. I don't, I don't Forget, know. forget, forget. First of all, B has Suki, is... Avatar Roku, Fire Lord Ozai. Why not compare? <laughs> all I'm saying is if you take what they mean, as in it was a big turning point for most of the the arcs these guys were m most turning points okay yeah c not really not strong enough turning points d didn't have that much meaning at all all right i will put him in c i don't think he could ever possibly be in b and i would put him either d or f but we can compromise and say C because I understand that it was him rebelling against the Fire Nation in that sense. Mm -hmm. So C, I think it sounds fine. Fine. Okay. Bum. The last melon. Delete S tier. So easy. Zuko, His come arc on. is one <laughs> to to just look back on if you ever want to have your villain become a good guy. You can't listen. You can't. Your there's nothing villain. wrong with Zuko. You're a villain. He's fucking perfect. He's perfect in every way of mm -hmm. how he's written. The whole speech that he has when he goes against his dad and... Okay, the speech that he goes against his dad where he's like everything he's learned and shit like that and like and it's not even my job to defeat you and stuff like that and the fact that I didn't even notice like until recently he redirects the lightning and purposely aims at his feet to not kill his dad when he could have just ended it right there yeah. because it wasn't his job like come on dude That's all you the do. fucking Agni Kai everything Ugh. he did that he did S, that. Excellent. Easy. Easy. Zuko deserves S tier because of how influential and mm. just inspiring of a character Easy. he was. Just in every single season. He grew every single season. Just a little bit, a little bit, a little bit. So good. He was the blue spirit in the first season. The second season... Ponytail man. Ponytail. On the run. With his uncle. So good. Second season. Well, I mean, third season. He, Turning to he a thought guy. everything was fine. And, and he was like, okay, I guess I'll return to normal. But it was never normal. And he realized that. And he realized he was on the wrong side. <sighs> Ain't nothing we can say that hasn't already been said. Excellent character excellent ah oh. all right so we already said we wouldn't make changes to this list but mm -hmm. final thoughts s tier i wouldn't he make even a, got a change. pet dragon he did he did in fact get a pet dragon too s tier perfect perfect list yeah a tier you yes. think you think yoshi should be higher i believe so as one of the avatars with the most importance i believe like R roku i don't think he did that much in his term mm. as avatar k 
Kiyoshi <laughs> totally term. fucking did. Mm. When the Earth Kingdom was going nutto. She is higher than him, so that stands. Honestly, Boomy could probably be lower, but I still fucking love him. Boomy's... And he is, again, a super influential yeah. for Aang, so... And he's also in the White Lotus. Sokka so perfect. I he is... He, yeah. He's one of the best ones in the White Lotus. Let's be very yes. clear. But he's not as good as Iroh. Absolutely. Iroh... Come on. Whoa. <laughs> B, I think pretty solid... Yeah. I don't think I'd make any changes personally. I mean, if we had to verse people against each other. Oh, versing people. Be, it's a different fucking thing. <laughs> oh, story. yeah. I mean, fucking, you got a bloodbender here. You got, you got a lot of people that could kill other people. Yeah. I mean, she's just a moon. She can get fucked yeah. up. <laughs> she can't. She can't now, I guess. <laughs> but still. <laughs> See, um, seems fine. This is like the weird turning point where I think a lot of people could go either up or down. If they but just I'd kinda had be a little like, you know, bit more. Yeah. That's fine. Tylee had the most shallow fucking storyline <laughs> ever. Oh, all my sisters are pretty like me. I don't get any attention. See, I don't even remember that, so whatever. <laughs> so I joined a circus. <laughs> D, I think is fine. Um, they're all just kind of barely characters. They're barely characters. Momo's cool, but again, like, Appa served as, like, the companion character. Yeah. Whereas he was just, like, another bit of it. And she's more just comic but comedic relief. But if we take into account that he <gasps> is Gyatso reincarnated. Now, if that's a thing, then sure. <laughs> then I would believe it. But, but that's then, just like, a what theory. the hell, Gyatso? Do something else! Yeah, that's just a theory. <laughs> Uh, F tier, I would argue probably against the dad being an F, but I don't care that the much. The dad is an F. I don't care that F. much. You left your children. <laughs> I don't care that much. De he F. Didn't. Dad be, be dad F. It would be one thing if, like, they were. Katara was even like, what the hell? Yeah, we were she just was pissed. Kids. Sokka it would be, was like, why do I even look up to you? <laughs> it would be one thing if, like, they were actually making a difference in the war, mm -hmm. but they would have just died. Let's be real here. <laughs> if, yeah. if they didn't get the help it of the just, kids, just they would have just died. Um, and then asshole, again, I don't see it entirely as lower than F. I just see it as, like, more of an, a dickhead in that sense. Yeah, like, you, you had a genuine hate for these people. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Hate. For these people hate <laughs> i think it's a solid list i think even if you had arguments against it they wouldn't be any more than like one or t or one up or one down i think we did good yeah and honestly most of our opinions mashed up to an extent i at am least happy of with like this. one bar yeah there's some some things yeah <laughs> but it's final and it's correct it's fine we're done all right <laughs> Different thing. Very chill. Liked it. I like doing these. Might do more. We'll see. So, anyway. Goodbye, everybody. Bye. <laughs>